quite a shooting performance in the first half. Yeah, we did some good things. I thought we shared the ball pretty well. We moved it around and worked the ball inside out. You know, Wright's a good basketball team. They've had a lot of success lately. You know, they played Bighorn pretty tough the regional last year. Uh, they're coming in with a lot of returning starters. Um, Dallas Millen, a heck of an athlete. I think he's been a four-year starter there. We knew with him we'd have our hands full, but uh, I really feel like we shot the ball well enough to win and that uh, we did a pretty good job handling him on the glass and keeping him from getting the, into his game offensively. What do you, what do you, what do you think Brody West's best skills are? Uh, he's a creator for us. He takes care of the ball, gets us into our stuff. You know, every once in a while he gets a little impatient and forces the issue a little bit. But as we grow together as a team, you know, we only had the one starter back, and that's Madsen from last year. But as we build, I think we'll just get better and better as the season goes on, and he's definitely going to be the, the catalyst for that. You know, and Madsen brings some size for you guys, which you, you need. Yeah, absolutely. Our league's really tough. You know, uh, Buffalo's really good, and everybody knows Douglas. Um, they're uh, definitely the – the superior team in the 3A East right now, obviously, with what they did to Orland last night. And Riverton's playing really well over there on the West, knocking off three, four, eight teams to start the year. So the league's loaded with talent. Um, the other 14, I think there's a lot of parity amongst us in the 3A. So uh, with those two at the top, the rest of us are really battling it out. And, you know, maybe somebody can catch one of those guys on a bad night. But the league's going to be uh, full of talent, that's for sure. Looks like Madsen has the attitude to rebound. He does. He gets after it pretty well. Um, you know, he's up and down this weekend. Uh, today was a tall order for our kids, uh, playing the early game this morning and then this last game tonight. But uh, Madsen's a tough kid. He's going to play aggressively and uh, got himself in some early foul trouble. But uh, he's definitely somebody we need cleaning up the boards. As we move forward to maybe next week and the week after, what are you be working on? Uh, we're just going to be working on better possessions, taking care of the ball. Um, I thought tonight in the second half especially, we, we took some shots too early in our offense. Uh, we needed to run through a little bit. Uh, we missed quite a few layups out of our pick and roll game that we could have had. And we've all also, that we just didn't get the pass there, but we also missed some layups taking the ball to the basket. So we're going to work on continuing to execute, but execution with finishing. With one returning starter, I mean, is there a lot of more teaching this year, you think? You know, it's probably one of the smartest teams I've coached. We may not have the, the skill set that some of our teams in the past have had, but we play really smart. Uh, we share the ball. We know where we're supposed to be, and we're getting pretty good at understanding where our teammates are going to be, and that's huge. You know, that's a, if you have great athletes and don't have that, you're not very good, and, and vice versa. But um, I like where we are as a team, and I think we're just going to gel and keep getting better every week.